Ladies and gentlemen, it's Andre. I am back with another one minute review. Today we are going to be reviewing the Beer Shark. This nifty little gadget right here. Go ahead and check that guy out. It's actually a smiling face on there, the Beer Shark. Now, I can already hear you asking yourself, Andre, what in the absolute heck is the Beer Shark? Well, guess what? You're in luck. I'm about to tell you what the Beer Shark is. Ask yourself this. How many times have you ever been getting together with some friends, let's say you're going out downtown, let's say especially you're getting to a house party, right? And you're late, you know, you're the last guy to the party. Everybody else has already been there having a few drinks. They're already feeling good. You get to the party, guess what you were in? Ketchup mode, that's right, you were in ketchup mode. Now in ketchup mode, there's a few problems with that. Either A, you try to drink a large amount of drinks in a very short amount of time, you resort to shots. Next thing you know, you're either bloated or B, nine times out of 10, you are now the drunkest kid at the party. You're actually drunker than the individuals that have been there longer than you. The Beer Shark is going to solve all of those issues and problems, dilemmas that you are faced with. Shotgunning beers. Now, I can already hear the trolls. I, yep, yep, I can hear you already saying, Andre, I don't, I don't need some tool that can allow me to do a Beer Shark. I, I can do it with a, a pocket knife in my pocket, or I can do it with my keys. Wrong, sir wrong ma'am you are wrong now anybody that's ever done a shotgun knows that if you try to puncture that beer with a key say you usually either a are making a very small hole that you can't even drink the beer out of b you're gouging this can back and forth back and forth trying to make it larger you either end up cutting your mouth when you go to do that sh uh, shotgun or you cut your finger in the process of doing that or the worst of all three Here's the Bud Light, I'll show you for example, when you go to puncture this guy, beer goes everywhere. Who the hell wants that? I sure as hell don't. So, the Beer Shark is going to solve all those issues. Now we're gonna show you how to do this guy. You have a nice ice cold Miller Light, that's what I choose to drink. You don't have to drink Miller Light, you can drink any type of beer you want. But this is what I prefer. How are you gonna do this guy? I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can show you a little bit. You wanna make sure you get that air bubble right there, right? You wanna puncture this guy with the beer shark. As you can see, there's no gouging, there's no popping, there's no doing crazy stuff. You're just poking this guy right here. Okay, so for the sake of the video, I kinda of effed up too, but hey, it's okay, it's okay. Now, we've made a nice hole here. It's a nice clean cut. You don't have to worry about cutting your mouth, doing anything crazy like that. If you don't have fingernails like myself, you can use this back side of the tool to kinda of do your little prop there. And the rest is just all about user. Now, I'm not the best shotgunner in the world, but I sure as heck try. So let's give her a gouge here, and uh, I don't even know what that means to give her a gouge, but let's give her a go and, and see how we can do it. <sighs> Woo! That was terrible. Terrible, I got it all over myself. Um, I would almost think I'm doing a hate uh, review on this, but I really do like this piece. Um, I've been using it for a little while. My buddies all made fun of me when I got it, but it is a very convenient tool to have, especially when you're at the beach. Um, you can keep it on your key ring. I will say if you have it on your key ring in your pocket, it has a tendency to poke your leg. Um, it doesn't feel too good. But uh, I will leave a link below so you guys can check this beer shark out. Um, as always, make sure you subscribe to the page if you haven't already. Um, please like and uh, spread the word. And uh, yeah, this has been Andre with another one minute review. Woo! Let's go, baby!